It doesn't matter whether you're a lawyer or a street sweeper, sooner or later, you're going to meet with the Reaper. Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Chesh from CheshirePlaysGames slash CheshBreaks.com.au and I'm going to rip a whole box of Time Spiral for myself. Why? Because I wanted to. I think that that's fine, right? Absolutely. So we're going to rip into this box uh, and we're going to see what kind of delicious, awesome, cool stuff we can get. Uh, and we will sort of go from there, I guess. Wow. It, it's been a while. It's been a while since I've cracked myself some, uh, a, I guess, a full box of magic product. There's been quite some time. Not doing this on, on the overhead, instead I'm recording it on my camera because it's a little bit clearer um, on the camera. Should we do the talk? Let's, let's destroy the box and do the talk. It's fine. Not a whole lot of space. Um, I'm working out of the office. Uh, and I'm just, I still really don't have it set up very well. Uh, my hand here is actually hitting on the monitor. And the phone is falling down. You know, still to be expected, really. Oh, I don't think I've ever sounded this awkward before in my life, to be honest. That's cool, though. Alright, let's just move this box over. Nah. Don't have any sleeves. They're here somewhere. Um, if we get a foil thought sees, obviously I will scramble to get some sleeves. Gonna maneuver this a little bit more. Give it some more space. Again, just because I keep hitting the monitor. Alright. Good luck to me. I don't think we really care that much about the, uh, the commons, do we? I mean, except for Grape Shot, maybe. Do we even care about the Uncommons? Not really. Griffin Guide, Crescent Grip, uh, Maya Bowl. And, well, there's an uh, Extapate as our first card. Oh, okay, cool. And we've got an Old Boarded Hedron Archive. Uh... Yeah, I should have just thought about this a little bit better, to be honest. But that's fine. Let's uh, put our uncommons over there. And then let's chuck these just in the box. And leave our rare and alt and, I guess, foils on that side over there. I can also really think about where I'm going to be throwing all these boosters. So I'll just chuck them on the ground uh, and clean them up later. That's fine. Alright, here we go. Uh, yeah. Sulfur Elemental, Riptide Pilferer, and uh, Trump the Domains. And hey, Summoner's Pact. Well, that's great because I needed one of those. And Young Pyreezy. Cool. Starting off strong. Uh, I want to see a Pact of Negation though. I actually don't have a copy of Pact of Negation, believe it or not. Not a single one. Bad, bad, terrible magic player. Alright, so we got a foil. Infiltrator Ilkor. Our alt border is our Pan Harmonicon, which is cool. And a Urbog Tomb of Yorgmoth, which used to be a fairly expensive card, to be honest. Now, obviously, not as much. going down in price thanks to uh, reprinting, which is part of the reason that reprints exist in the first place. Try and bring prices down just a little bit. So that people like me can afford to uh, remain in the hobby. Old Border, Read the Bones. And our rare is Safi, Eric's daughter. So 
somebody was asking me if there was anything in particular I was looking from the set, and you know, I don't, I don't have a plan. I don't have anything set. I do not remember if there was anything in particular I was chasing. Um, I just haven't been able to rip any magic for a while. Time of Need, that's pretty cool. And Talaria West. Always nice to have a second Talaria. We are gearing back up into con season. Australia's doing... Oh, sorry, Brisbane. <laughs> Most of Australia's doing pretty good on... Um, Rolling back COVID here at the moment, which is fantastic. Fender Blast, that's always cool. And Megas the Moon. No foil rare yet. So there's some talk about Oz Comic Con uh, happening. Dates of that are up. If you have a look at the Australian Trading Card Association Facebook and Instagram. We need to go and update the site at some point soon. Because it's a bit boring. Thrag Tusk. There's a nice one to get. And, ooh, that's our first mythic, which is Krovax Ascendant Hero. And there's our own comments. I don't know, when a set's been out for a while, or, or reprinted as this is, I just don't think the uncommons matter that much. They just don't. Because you've seen all the uncommons. I mean, we'll probably just buzz past them, to be honest. Flagstones. And hey, that's cool. Lavinia. It's very cool. Take a sip of drink. Whew. Commander Crunch, of course, our podcast. CommanderCrunch.fireside.fm Get it where you get all your good podcasts, because it is a great podcast. It's been going really well. We, uh, we actually have some very cool guests coming up as well. Ivory Giant. Is our foil from that pack. Our old water is Beast Whisperer, one of my favourite cards, so I'm happy to get that. And Kerr Keep, because at some point apparently I'm going to need to make kobolds, I guess. Slivers. I haven't even looked at prices of magic for a while. Like, I've just been doing NBA, just hardcore. Um, what was the online store taking off? Uh, doing a lot of convention work, doing some small, some small conventions, I guess you could say. Thanks, Tommy. Go away. Uh, yeah, for my dryad. Very cool. Our old border is Kiki Jiki. And then, uh, oh, we got our Pact of Negation that we wanted. Fantastic. All right. Well, ooh, rough and tumble. Cool. Uh, so far, this box has been fine for me. So uh, it's been it's been a sort of a win. I guess that's the card that we should say that we, you know, the packs. We want all of the packs. Um, and from what I've been seeing, a lot of people have been getting like a copy of each pack. Generally speaking, uh, which would be nice to have a whole set of those packs. It'd be a first time. I actually missed Time Spiral the first time around. Um, it was during one of my hiatuses, I believe. Uh, Anger of the Gods. I believe that was a rare. Uh, Greater Gargadon. No idea why that's a rare. <laughs> I'm funny to myself. Cringeworthy conversation. Heaps of packs to go. My goodness, my back is already hurting. Archvorezka, and Sudden Spoiling, uh, 
Archer Rascal looks great in the old border. Just brings me back to like the foil DCI wasteland. Um, from when there were still player rewards, DCI player rewards. And the wasteland in the old border has just looked amazing. Uh, Vampire Hex Mage, very good for combo decks, lands decks. Uh, Akuruma's Memorial is our second uh, very awesome mythic for Commander, which is fantastic. So that's two mythics so far. Just remember that time shifted cards technically don't have a rarity, I believe. Um, somebody was saying that they were all on the same rarity sheet. With the equal rarity, which I think is very interesting. Not something I was expecting. Okay, so Tendrils of Corruption is our foil. Old Boarded Exquisite Firecraft. And Stuffy. Stuffy Combo Piece. Stuffy Combo Piece now. That's, uh, that's the new official nickname. Or as I like to call it, the annoying shit card that I hate. That's fine. Don't worry Sam, I didn't say the C word. Flicker Wisp. And... Okay, Pulmonic Sliver. Let's see this have flying. Ooh, Harmonize. Because I needed another one to add to my pile of like a thousand Harmonizers. <laughs> Hashtag just command to play a thing. How oh, nice. I don't know if I've got a copy of that. Buy a copy. Put it onto the, the copy that you have like 10,000 of. It's like buying onions. Do I have any onions at home? Oh, I'll just buy one just in case. Cloud Key is our rare foil. Our old border is a Johnny's Pride Mate. And our rare is a Tomb Stalker. Brand Elemental. Oh, nice. Blimey. Pickles. Strict Hagen spoilers are in full swing. I'm not going to tell you about them, but uh, there's some interesting stuff coming into. Yeah, I don't know, man. Uh, unless you smile to death. And Magus of the Future. Just a rare, right? I was like, can't can't be a mythic. Really? Can't be a mythic, man. It's not good enough. No foil uh, time shifted card yet. We're hoping we'll be lucky enough to get one. Elvish Mystic. It's a cool time shifted card. Uh, Glittering Wish. The wish that no one really cares about. <laughs> it's not true. Just, you know, I'm a commander player. Whatever. Do what I want. Command what I want, yo. Ugh. Old Border Dragon Protector. And Pact of the Titan. Is that three packs down? <laughs> this is uh, going to be a longer video than I thought because there's just so many boosters in here. These boxes, of course, I got this one at 300 with the promo, uh, and now they're just skyrocketed. Sanguine Blood and Bangara of Corondor. I always just want to say Mangara Condor because I'm an idiot. Can have enough slivers for a sliver deck. No one wants that. And no, I will not be making slivers great again, Orcs Head. Because I know you're going to watch this and that's probably the first comment you're going to have about that. Don't make me do a bad accent. Alright, so our foil time shifted card is Beast Within. 
And a time shifted card is Vanquishes Banner. And we have a rare of Benalish Commander. Oh, we can all just go home now. <laughs> I actually don't know how much Beast Within is worth. I'm sure it's worth something. Like foil time shifted Beast Within. Commander player's gonna be all over it. That's how that works, isn't it? Foil? Sparrow of Ancient. Time shifted? Laboratory Maniac? Followed by Wheel of Fate as our mythic. This pile of uncommons is getting a bit unwieldy. So uh, we'll just chuck them off to the side just there so I don't tip them over. Because we all know what the chess is like. Fumbly fingers will fumble the fingers of Flumberlist. Uh, so we got a full Fury Sliver. We have a Time Shifted Yorgmoth Thrand Physician, which is great, because I actually wanted one. Uh, and we have a Draining Quelk. I know that you can be Underwhelk, and I know that you can be Overwhelk, but can you just be Draining Whelk? The answer is yes. Uh, where are my sleeves? Uh, top Loaders. You know what? I don't think I have sleeves around. Which is frustrating. Mm mm mm. Okay, well, just gonna put it over there for a second. Right. On camera, Al. This is gonna be torturous to watch back, I apologize. True Name Nemesis, that's a nice hit. Uh, and, ooh. Muriganda Petrifus? I guess. That's how it sounds to me. There's a lightning axe. That no one cares about. Not even me. Maybe we'll get another foil time shifter, that'd be nice. Get that, uh, what is it? A ponder or a pre or something? I don't remember. Our rare is Jura, and our time shifted is not Gumeg Ingla. Oh, you almost 30 minutes. Time shifted, Rectus Charm, and our rare is a Vesuvenet Shapeshifter. Wish we had the great technology back when I originally started working in a store and playing magic. To what we have today, it would have been great. Uh, giant. Dust Wasp. Time shifted is. Geez, what is that? Stonehorn Dignitary? Yes. So hard to read. Uh, and Angel of Salvation. That's what happens when you're legally blind, kids. Hashtag look after your eyes. Well, I mean, I did, and it didn't help. Genetic disease. Time shifted is a contagion clasp, and our mythic is Teferi Mage of Zephyr. 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 Frank Zappa. Great. Time shifted, Goblin Engineer, that's pretty cool. Uh, Sarah Avenger. Don't worry, we're 
almost there. We're almost there. We're pretty close. Not even a single thought to this though. Not that I should be expecting one, but... Containment Priest, because we needed that printed again. Uh, ooh. If High Arcanist. That's cool. Very expensive. Dread Return, of course. Great Uncon, who was worth at least a little bit of money. Uh, has been since, I believe, reprinted a number of times throughout different products. Try and reduce down its uh, cost a little bit. Time shifted is a repel. It's repel, Al. Repel. And, ooh. Felon of Havenwood. Is that rare? Just the thought of having to go back through this all and. Uh, just too much. Just too much. Having to sort through everything. Actually, cleaning is going to be worse. Time shifted Prime Evil Titan. Cloud Key. Prime Time, of course. Uh, a deck that I like to run. So having an old border is uh, is very cool, and so Hayden would be a very jealous. Ooh, our second time shifted foil is a Vandal Blast. Time shifted is a Palace Jailer, and our rare is a Hive Stone. Legit, just thought I. Just dumped the camera just then. Foil Orkish Cannonade. Time shifted remand. So we got repeal and remand. Uh, and perfury nodes as a rare. Last two booster packs. Thank you for hanging out for so long. Almost uh, 25 minutes of magic uh, auditory goodness. Got a foil. It is a faceless devourer. Oh boy. Come on, get back up there. Here you go. Time shifted. Consuming apparition. And our. Eh, yes. <laughs> Ion, Aeon Chronicler. I was just like, I'm pretty sure it is. I don't remember it being printed at Mythic. But you know. Old man brain and all that. Plus being blind. Got to the 25 minute mark. Let me crack this one really quickly. Thanks for hanging out. Like, comment, subscribe. There's a foil. Foil rare to finish this off. That's pretty cool. And then we've got a Harvester of Souls, and hey, Mythic Living End. Fantastic. That's it. Box ripped. Ripped, broken, beaten, sore. So, let's have a look back through, and let's try and separate out our Mythics, and we'll go through them. Alrighty then, so we got only four mythics from the box, which is about right. There's usually between four and six. So Chroma's Memorial, Wheel of Fate, Teferi, and Living End. So nothing like amazing there, or nothing too exciting. Uh, but we did get a Foil Vandal Blast, uh, Time Shifted, a Foil Beast Within Time Shifted, 
and a primeval titan, along with some other really cool time shifted cards as well. Uh, was it was it a box worth opening? No, like it it never is. The only reason that I generally will open a box is for my own feeling, because I sometimes I just want to bust something. Um, and generally not for profit, because you're not going to profit out of it. If there's cool stuff that I want in the set, or the cool stuff that's possible in the set, I'll open a box, because I'm a commander player, and something like, you know, uh, well, obviously not Primeval Titan, because I'm pretty sure it's still banned in Commander, but something like Hedron Archive in the old border is pretty cool, or Pan Harmonicon, you know. Um, but, hey, thanks for hanging out. I have been Chesh. Uh, I guess I have to say the stupid like, comment, subscribe crap. Uh, keep your eyes out for more stuff coming from us folks at Commander Crunch and our guests. And uh, yeah, if you're in Australia, keep your eyes locked on Oz Comic Con because there could be some stuff coming up uh, in regards to not just trading cards, but trading card games, not unlike Magic the Gathering. That is all in the future. Alright, thanks for hanging out everyone. See ya!